Finally, the Arcana are here in this beta, 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 Britta update, and I feel like a 12 year old just showed me his marbles. Note to myself, word that differently, that sounds very wrong. But yes, it is true, the beta update is here, and as you can see, we have new achievements, so let's go over them. We have to find a Randomazzo on the Gallo Tower, we have to open a coffin in the Indate Library. I'm actually not too sure why. I guess it's just... No, I actually don't know why. Um, next, next up, we have to fill 70 entries in the collection. Hold on. Okay, I gotta check something in a second. For an additional banish, yes, before I forget what that even does. For now we have four achievements, but this is just the first part of the beta update. There will be more because a total of 10 achievements will be in there. So yeah, this is just one part. Oh yeah, and I have found the other one. Survive 15 minutes with Giovanna and this will unlock a cat? Uh, so yeah, survive 15 minutes with Gatti Amari is the weapon called. Now I did want to check something because... Yeah, th there are only 68 collectibles right now. I I can't unlock the banish. Well, let's wait until the beta updates. Keep in mind, the beta is not the live version. This is a test version, pretty much, to check out everything. And the developer said there will be most likely changes this time, because a lot is more complicated with the Arcana. By the way, here's what he wrote. You can just pause and read through it. But I would say, let's just get going. I'm, I'm super excited. Let's do this. I'll take Red Death. We want to rush up to the top of the Gallo Tower, so uh, yeah, let's, let's just do that. Oh, and as you can see, this is mentioned, the clock speed is now times 1 times 2. A lot of people were confused what Terry Mode even does, because the game still lasts until 30 minutes, uh, but they didn't realize that <laughs> the seconds were passing twice as fast. But let's go for it. Okay, there we go, there we go. Ooh, I see a green arrow. Let, let's just rush there, let's just rush there. I actually have to attend a meeting in 22 minutes, so <laughs> yeah, I actually really have to rush there. <laughs> so this video will be a bit shorter, pretty much what I'll do is, <laughs> I'll record this now, and like two minutes before I have to go to the meeting. Who did? No, that's, that's, okay, never mind, never mind, that, that's just a brainstorm, I, I got excited for nothing. So yeah, because I have to leave, pretty much what I'll do is, I'll record now, and I'll just edit it while I'm in the meeting, and then upload it, <laughs> so, uh, sorry, it's a bit shorter. But, um, whoa, ho, 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 ho. do I have to kill you guys? No, I don't have to. Enables the unlocking of, of the Arcana in the activation. Yes, there we go. What did I get? Dude, healing is doubled. Recovering HP damages nearby enemies for the same amount. Well, first of all, hilarious. Because I, I actually thought that this would be a thing. But I thought it was with another one. I think the last one, right? Do you remember the video where I looked at all the artwork of the Arcana? If you didn't see it, link is of course in the pinned comment. But, ooh, it looks like we can have three Arcana. Okay, let's leave. Find the Arcana, we did that, we did that. And... How, how do I unlock the character? Oh, this is so amazing. Oh, this is really amazing. Okay, so I can choose one out of six, huh? So I guess I could... Ch I, I don't understand this fully yet. I think there are only four Arcana in the game right now. And they will come in with the update. So let's just do this. And I think... Oh yes! Look at this! There's a question mark. That's a coffin. So what do I do now? Do I deal damage with this? It said it deals the damage that I heal to enemies, right? So let, let me get a chicken. Let me, let me get a chicken. But yeah, I did do an Arcana video that shows off all the artwork. I will link it in the pinned comment, so feel free to check it out and guess what the rest is doing. And as always, I will spam out videos of the update while the beta is out and you can't play it yet if you don't want to opt into the beta. And of course, once the update is out and I'll do a stream today of the content. So if you're as excited as I am, then feel free to subscribe and you can just join me on the adventure to explore everything. I actually have no idea how to get the other Arcana. Like, I understand how to get the first one. We just got that by unlocking, but where's the rest? Let me show guides. There we go. And I really like that it's not that far away, right? Like, for some of the other new things, you had to run, like, I, I don't know, some miles over there. But this is actually... Yeah, this is decent. I like that a lot. New. Oh, uh, yeah. You just ruined my new. That is not funny. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Uh, Dex, this is not the first coffin you unlock. Why did you just run in there? Okay, I need some damage. Give me some some damage. 
Uh, whip. Yeah, whip, whip is decent early damage. Can I just stand in the middle like I did in Mad Forest? Oh, amazing. Okay, that will make it super easy. See ya in five minutes. Okay, I wasn't kidding when I said five minutes, am I? Because these guys down there are just pulling down further and further and further. So, you know what? Let's just, um... Oh, oh I wanted Pentagram. Pentagram just wipes them out and it's easy peasy. That one guy at the bottom is really leaving far. Okay, there we go. Yeah, and these are also really far pushed out. You actually have to be careful that you don't knock them out of the screen and can't reach them anymore. Oh, I think there's only one left. I, okay, I got them. I got... Yes! Giovanna? Giovanna? Thank you, Master of the Red Death, but the vampire is in the coffin. Yes, yes, yes. I know the very first time I failed to get the reference. But I have it. Super Mario. So, let's go. Giovanna Grana. Joins... What is it? Grana. Uh, good question. Okay, there we go. I just instantly want to play. Yeah, we got her. So let's make a very quick round. I really have to make a quick round. Uh, gains 1% projectile speed every level. Amazing. Oh! Oh, wow! Wait, since we... Oh my god! Reach level 99... Oh no! Oh wow, that's... um, That's a lot. That is a lot more than I expected. <laughs> I can't do that now. Let's take a quick look at Giovanna, and yeah, then I have to quit eventually. So let's play on hurry mode, and let's just play on the library. This is the map I know the most of. Uh, yes. Recovering HP damages nearby enemies for the same amount. Honestly, this could make the whip actually decent. Okay, Song of Mana. So, guys. There's a kitty! There's actually a kitty! And a black one. What are they doing? It's, it's a bit hard to say. Um, so they are walking around and scratching. The character gains base speed up by 20%. Nice, let's go for it. The character gains 1% speed per level up. So I assume speed is really good on them. But I wonder if they always deal damage or only when they scratch. Um, interesting. Oh my god, I bet you Slash has bleeding damage. Like, please have bleeding damage. Let me have this one. The cats look absolutely amazing. I'm just not too sure what to think about them yet. There we go. Effect lasts 1.5 seconds longer. Well, yes, sure. Don't mind me if I do. And as you can see with the hurry mode, the time is ticking twice as fast. Nothing changed about that. It's just now that it's described a bit better to understand, I assume. What are you doing? Oh! To the black cat, to the white cat, and then they started going crazy. I think yes. Wait, that is a... No, but they just hit each other, the black and the white one over here. That was not it. So... What is going on with the music? <laughs> Wait, I just realized that the music is amazing. <gasps> Duplicator? Do you think that affects them? Um, I would say I have more cats around. Maybe, maybe not. No, 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 it definitely affects them. Okay, fires one more projectile. Usually the best way to know what works on weapons is just look at what they get via level ups. It doesn't mean that this is all that affects them, but usually cooldown affects every single weapon in the game. Well, like 99% of them. And the rest you can just get from the level ups that the weapon has. Oh boy, guys, you know what's coming. You know what's coming. Of course, Infinity Cat build, okay? Of course it will come. I'm sorry, but everything else has to be paused. I, th this is just straight up amazing. In case you don't know what Infinity Weapons are, I mod the game in a way that you can only have one singular weapon. Not, not other, like no passive weapons, no active weapons, aside from the one Infinity Weapon. And then I reduce the base stats of that weapon so it's weaker, but you can put infinite level ups on it. So yeah, these videos usually become quite crazy and I can't wait to see that with these kittens. Or cats? Kittens, kittens are the, the baby ones, right? Yeah, yeah. Well, maybe they are. I don't know. They don't look like it. Oh, would it be worth it to make a best build for these? Like where I look at the stats and look at what works the best to buff up the most? Yeah, probably. I think I'll actually do that. That is, of, of course, unmodded, right? Man, I don't know what's going on with the cats, like when they hit each other. Is it maybe just a white and a white cat hitting each other? 
It might also be a chance that just depends on luck, maybe? It would be so hilarious if the white cats actually have a higher chance of fighting, the higher your luck is. Yeah, okay, I saw two black cats hitting each other here. So it's the same colored cats. Interesting. Oh, this will be... Oh, this will be a very weird infinity video. While the infinity videos are usually a lot of fun, the problem is everything gets out of hand, and if you imagine like 50 cats on your screen, all of them fighting... <laughs> Oh, healing! Okay, did I do damage to the enemies around me? I, yeah, I, I'm, hmm, I'm not sure. Did I just heal for 50 or 60? Oh, I don't want to, I don't want to go into the meeting, man. It's only 10 minutes left. Come on. Um, reroll. Oh, we have four skips. That's amazing, right? They got doubled. Oh, that's so good. So I kind of want to focus on if it's just two random cats and kids. It's it's so hard to see. Like for you, you can just focus on other stuff, but I have to focus on playing as well. If you've seen a white cat and a black cat get into a fight, please let me know. Because so far my theory is only the same colored cats can do it. Um. Yeah, let's actually get crown. I need to level up a bit faster. I'm really falling behind. Ah, professional decks definitely left on the damage numbers, but man, these cats do a lot of damage if the enemy is inside of them. It's, it's not that much when they get pushed back all the time, but it's actually quite decent. I guess, maybe? Um, they might need spinach to be able to do their stuff. Well, but you can leave them on the ground as a puddle. Like, look at this, just like Labora, you know, where you leave them behind you and let all the enemies spawn on top of them. Be Johnny! Of course we go for you. Huh. Yeah, I'm not too sure what to think of them, but I mean, 20 damage actually sounds quite okay. It also looks like the cats do despawn if you walk away too far from them. Just like, you know, like when Labora's on the ground and you walk away. Like, look at this. And I will go over. Yeah, there's nothing anymore on the ground. And they actually do last quite some time. Talking about lasting, what duration increase this, I wonder? I should have probably checked the level ups a bit better, but the thing is just, I'm in a rush. Dude, it's really hard to see what's going on with all the effects here. Okay, there's the chest. With that, I can evolve. I want to evolve the... Gun? What? What was that? Isn't this the chest from the 10-minute boss? What was this? Huh? Okay... Did anyone see where I got this chest from? There's no boss that should have spawned here at 11 minutes. Was this chest on the floor for a while and I just didn't notice it? Weird. Okay, I'm so confused. Like, I know at 12 minutes a bat spawns and yet yeah, the over there it is. But at 10 minutes nothing should spawn. And the boss at 8 minutes I killed ages ago. Huh? Oh yeah, I was about to say I can evolve the guns finally, but I just realized I, I, I need Tiragisu. Why do I always go for the guns in these update videos just because they're a new weapon? Like, it, ooh, spinach, let's go. It makes everything more difficult than it needs to be. Okay, I gotta be honest, I actually think the cats are not bad. They are a bit rough to deal with, and they kind of don't want you to move around. Which is uh, the opposite of what you do many, many times in the game for a lot of record runs. But aside from that, like, if you just stand still or, you know, don't move away too far, it, it looks really good. What, what, what were these sounds? Did I heal? I'm pretty sure I didn't heal. Tiragisu, there we go, finally. Okay, let's, let's pick up this chest here. There we go. Oh, right, yeah. Uh, uh, over here. There we go. Thank you. And now I'll head over and get the empty tome. Oh, the bonus speed will make the Firachi so insanely fast. Yeah, this will be interesting. And I often get this question, why is my Firachi pulsing? This also happens to you if you don't have enough cooldown. That's why I'm heading over there to get cooldown. Huh. I wonder if the second chest was what was mentioned, that the 10 minute chest can give you an arcana. But I didn't get one, right? Well, I guess I can't get one because I have none others unlocked. Yeah, 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 makes sense. 
Okay, the empty tomb should be on the next table. Come on, come on, come on. I still have a chest there that I want. Um, is this wild? Yes. Is this crazy? Yes. Is the music fitting? Hell yes. There we go. Empty tomb. Perfect. Yeah, perfect. Taking a bit too much damage. Ebony wings. There we go, man. That took very long. Look at my level. My nice level. Yeah, look at my level. Jesus, 91% speed. Oh, I can't wait to go for a projectile build. Oh, okay, I have a crazy idea. Do you remember when I once did the co-op video with the cherry bomb bone um, rune tracer, right? Where it was modded and I only had these weapons. I could do this on this character with the cat and with some other weapons. Right now I can think of four. Cherry Bomb, Bone, Rune Tracer evolved, of course, and the cats. Oh my god, what is going on? <laughs> Everything is fighting. Yeah, but I can think of these four weapons. What other weapons should I use? Is Carello good enough or would it be too boring? Do we want to have Hirachi to just spin around like crazy or something else? Let me know. Okay, I have to turn off the damage numbers. My entire screen is filled in damage numbers everywhere. Uh, maybe that was a bit overkill what I went for. Look, look at the boss just walking through the cats and dying? Is he dead? Oh yeah, he's dead. There's a the chest. Yeah. So apparently the 20 minute boss also is supposed to give you an arcana or chance at it. I'm not too sure about it. Wait, was it another second chest here? Or was it from a past boss? Um, I'm actually not sure. Well, let's get Vandalia. I really want to see this with the high projectile speed that we have. Oh my god, look at the circles flying around. <laughs> Wait, where are the circles? Where's even the birdies attack? Uh, Vandalier? Editing decks here. If you're thinking, what the hell is wrong with me? How didn't I see that? I have no idea either. I'm actually starting to get concerned what's going on. I had this a couple of times where in the game, even when I knew where to look, and focus on the shots like here with the Vandalier, I didn't see it. I didn't see a single shot in the game. Now in the recording I clearly see them and I have no idea. I, I don't know what's going on. So just in case you're thinking, what the hell are you doing, Dex? I don't know. Does any one of you see Vandalier actually shooting? Oh yeah, he is! Okay, there it is, there it is. I don't know how I missed that. Weird. Dude, Ferracci is going absolutely crazy. This is insane. Okay, I have to pause now. The problem is I have to unplug my USB headset and this messes up the sound recording. Like, you won't hear me anymore or the game sound. I will break it here, but don't worry, I will make a dedicated video. And I have so many good ideas right now that I'll do with the cats here. But this is the first preview. As I said, if you enjoy the content, if you want to see more beta content and update content, feel free to subscribe. What the hell? Stop that. Can you also hear that? Uh, um, okay, I actually think I have to leave. <laughs> well, feel free to subscribe. See you next time. And I'm out. Jesus Christ. What is going on?